So guys, this is the third time I paid a Binance P2P order and I didn't manage to go back and click on paid. You know, um, I did it the first time, I made the video, I did it the second time, and now this is the third time, but this time around it happened to be a small amount, okay? So if I go deep to explain this, in this situation, so I can learn from, from mine, kindly subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any of our educative videos on trading, investing, and online business. And without further ado, let's dive in. Let's go back to my trade. So, guys, this trade two thirty one thousand and seventy naira. I traded with a particular user called Mo. So, um, after making the payment, I actually went out. I was going somewhere before. I need to get somewhere before two, so so that I could, I could go and pray Juma. So I just quickly dashed to the place, but uh, fortunately, I didn't go back to mark as paid. So, and um, from previous experiences, I realized that those that trade huge amounts, millions, they are usually trustworthy. You know, if you message them, they give you back your funds. So this particular person, uh, uh, he played smart a little. Okay. So what I did was to to call him immediately, and he said he was going to do it. But after like uh, an hour, after like thirty minutes, I didn't do it. Okay. I went back and. Um, I clicked on appeal and I sent a message to support. Okay, then I gave him gave me a call again. He didn't pick my call, so I went to the chat and I told him that and I told him that please go ahead with the refund, sir. I need to pay the owner of the fund his naira back or send his USDT to him. Okay. So he told him that I hear you have similar issues. Paid someone a think last week. Requested timeout. And up to now, I've not received my funds. Okay? And I told him, please send the USDT on, on error as I've paid you. He told me that I will think of what to do. Maybe I'll remove the think and send the balance. <laughs> I laughed. I told him, you can't do that. Am I the person that, that took your think the guy said, oh, okay. So I told him, point black. I told him that if you want to scam me, do let me know. It's a small world. And I said, I know I've traded with you before, and you're a good person, but if you want to play otherwise, it's all good. So he said, bro, you serve a better person. I go run your money, no fears. I go run them. Where are they? Network, no good. So when he said, no fears, I said, okay. Um... No, the, the one thing is, you know, if it's a huge amount, I might, I might just try to play calm with the person. But I was playing Ash with this guy because I want him to just make the reform. Now, how much are you? How much did I send you that you want to like go with the form? So he said, so I didn't message him. Then he said again, I go run now. Where I did network no good, but you get your phones complete today. And I said, why, you, why are you behaving like this? I told you to send the USDT. You said no, that you want to make a refund. Now, I'm giving you my account number. Why are you delaying me? Because I sent my account number as well. So, um, he didn't reply. I told him, you are online and you refuse to send the USDT or make the refund to my bank account. No problem. I'm not going to call you or chat you up again. If you want legal action, it's fine by me. And I stopped replying him or send, calling him or chatting him up, okay? And he replied, what legal action is this chief talking about? I told you I was gonna refund you. That's where I, that where I was, I can't guarantee the transfer with the network. Once I get that, I will If you want to take legal action route, you can proceed, chief. They tell you saying that your money go make me. That legal action I ain't, I won't make you take safe. I did wait. All this way, I didn't reply him. Anyway, I was doing a Binance newbie walkthrough session, so I didn't have time to even check the chat. So I didn't reply him. So I think he was scared when he saw that I didn't reply him. And he was like, maybe I meant the legal action. Okay? So and he said, not all of us are into scam. And he sent the payment, sent the screenshot. Uh, he sent the font. And he said they had sent the font. So I told him, well received. No need for a legal action again. Thank you. So <clears throat> now I will now go ahead and first... Um, 
it's currently on appeal pending so i'll cancel this appeal because i've received the money by the way i checked my internet banking i checked my bank account and the money is there so i've i've, I've cancelled the appeal okay so the next thing i need to do is go to chat and go and message uh, uh binance support that the guy has already paid so they can leave the the guy the guy wanted to play smart well. assuming I, I wasn't ash on you he would have gone with the money but i realized that those that trade small amount on binance i won't go any more i trustworthy like 10k 20k 100k they will just run away so um good day admin kindly ignore the above message or dispute above message dispute or other id the stubborn seller has finally refunded my money okay so after doing that you know i can now go back so yeah at least i'm glad i got uh, i got the, the money back like this is the third time ah oh God. god will help me oh, with this sending of money and forgetting to click as as people it's, it's, it's all fine so um guys please and please make sure you click on pay though there's no guarantee me i was just calm and um i i i was quite certain with god i was certain i was going to get the money back so guys i'm not in any way saying that you should also forget to mark as paid though because uh, there's no guarantee you get your money back what binance support can just do is to restrict that account so if there's money in that account that's been restricted the person will not have a choice than to go ahead and what pay you okay but if there's money in the account it, if there's if, what if there's no money what if the person send all the money out and the person decide not to use the account again you know that's an issue for you because some people can go to that length okay so and uh, what i would say is if you encounter any issue and you message support and support has not replied to you go to the binance telegram group and pass your complaint to a what a binance angel so that they can forward it to admin immediately and they can take action because a lot of users usually drop support and you know, by the time they, are, they get to your own uh, message, it might have taken so long, okay? So that's just a little tip I will give. Don't be like, don't be like me. Although I've changed now, I've changed, okay? So now I'll make sure that I'm calm and I process all my order when I'm sitting down, okay? So guys, that's what I have for now. Um, I would like to hear from you. Where, where, where do you think the crypto market is going from here? Are we going up? Are we going down? Personally, I think we are going up from here, but the up might not be like the up. The up might not be too uppy. And what I mean by the up might not be too uppy is that as we are going up from here, guys, take some profit too. <laughs> take some profit. That's just my own little tip, little advice. So thank you, thank you very much. If you have further questions, put it in the comment section below. Um, before you leave, kindly subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any of my educative videos on trading, investing, and online business. And until next time, my good friend, keep learning. Bye.